What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon White 2 walkthrough. You see, I almost said Black 2 right there. Hmm, I don't know why. Probably because I'm getting the hang of doing this again? Probably, I don't even know. Anywho guys, in the last episode, we managed to defeat Clay for our fifth badge. Now it is time for us to actually go to the Pokemon World Tournament. You mean to tell me there are other Pokemon trainers wanting to take this throw? Well, I will not have it. So, we're gonna go follow our friend right here, and I, I can't believe it's winter! It's winter time! Holy crud, for the first time in my channel's history, we are in the winter time, and well, we have to follow, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, uh, we have to go follow Clay, we can't be going to Route 6 right now, so let's see, Pokemon World Tournament is down here, again guys, it's been a while since I've actually, well, this is probably like the first few times that I've been playing Pokemon Y2, not because I'm lazy or anything. It's just that you know, time, time consuming, and all that stuff. Don't really have the uh, don't really have that much time like I used to. And well, let's see. Ah, here we are. The Pokemon World Tournament has finally opened up. This is a brand new thing that we can actually find right here in uh, Pokemon White 2. And well, everybody calls me the Reminder Girl. I know every move that Pokemon learn while they're leveling up, and I can make Pokemon remember these moves. Of course, you're gonna have to bring me a heart skill. I'll make a Pokemon remember the move. Should it be remembered? Let's see. If I had a hard scale, I'd probably teach my Pokemon all their like pretty badass moves, but right now we don't have that. So anywho, here's Clay and Hugh waiting for us, and uh, here we are! Ooh. What'd you think? Rebuilding, huh? Here's where the Pokemon World Tournament make takes place. Ain't she pretty? Follow me, Tads! Or Tads or Lads? Wait, wait, is it Tads? Did he say Tads? Read that correctly, guys. If it's Tads, it's Tads or something like that. Anywho, here we are in the Pokemon World Tournament, and well, look at uh, our good old buddy uh, Charon is there. This time, I'm gonna have you participate in the Driftfield Tournament. Anything goes in here in this tournament, eight people will be participating, and if you win three times, you're the champion. Why did you wait? Why did you call me too? I'm looking to, into something. You know something, Charon? There's uh, there's uh, the one who's gonna show everyone that Pokemon Valley means is you. And your pal ain't here either. I'm counting on your power of, or the, on the power of youth, because everyone likes up and coming stars. Okay, whatever you're, uh, whenever you're ready, get over in the reception. Man, oh man, you never change, Clay. But the tournament itself does look pretty fun. Okay, I'll go register. Me too. Come on, let's have some fun. We'll battle plain and simple. Participate. I kind of want to go to the next place, but I kind of need to do this in order to. Yeah. <sighs> I guess I'll do it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so here we are in the Pokemon World Tournament, playoff style and everything. This place, it, you know, you will be progressing a little bit more throughout this whole thing right here. So, let's see. Uh, where do I register? Okay, so here we go. Welcome to the Pokemon World Tournament. Will you participate? Let's go with the info. Uh, about a battle per formats. Okay, so there are four formats to the tournament. Single, double, triple, and rotation. Single battles need three Pokemon. Double battles need four Pokemon. Triple battles need six. Rotation battles need for four Pokemon. And, uh, okay, so we kind of get that. And the Drift Veil, or Drift Veil, or I can't even pronounce these things right. I do not care, so... At last, Drift Veil tournament. In this tournament, anything goes. Any Pokemon, any held item can participate. The winner will be rewarded with BP. Good luck! Uh, okay, so if you guys don't know what BP is, it's pretty much like the currency around this area. That way you can actually buy some pretty cool stuff like TMs, or just uh, some pretty cool hidden, uh, or not hidden items, but pretty cool held items. So, let's, uh, no, not right there. Let's go right here. And, uh, let's see, the tournament's ready, so I don't think we, okay, what the heck? Alright, so, uh, where do we, oh, yeah, we're gonna go right here, never mind. So, as you can see, it's a playoff format, and from what I can look at right here, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, hmm, let's see, okay, so I gotta check, check up on my Pokemon first, because, let's see, um, we do have some pretty good, uh, stuff right here, Buckus, Big Booty Buckus as well, is doing some pretty good stuff right now, and anyway, well, like, I'm not gonna use, I don't wanna use Desert Storm, because, well, Obviously, its speed is, uh, it's pretty much, yeah, it's, it's not good. I could use Gigalith. And, you know what? Yeah, that's probably what's, what, what the case is going to be. Okay, so let's go ahead and register. Hello! 
Welcome to the exchange service corner. Would you like to trade your BP for fabulous prizes? No. Okay, so what do I have to do? Where do I go? Okay, whatever you're ready, go over to the reception. Where's the reception area? Right here? Hello. Welcome to... No. Okay. Seriously, man? This is getting annoying. Where's the reception area? Okay, so... Right here? We're getting special tournaments ready. It'll take a while to be patient. Okay, fine. I'm going to step outside, okay? I'm going to step outside. Where the heck is the reception area? Okay, go back inside. And... Uh, Alright, let's see. Let's try this again. Um, ah! Okay, I, let's see. This is the PC. Um, yeah, that's not gonna happen. Um, okay, what do I need to do? Seriously. Um, okay, reminder girl. Deleter moves, learn the Pokemon's hidden move, explore the relic passage. <sighs> okay, so this is a... This is a, let's see, far west, the exterior is a parallel relic passage, you'll fight trainers in the tunnel, your Pokemon will surely grow stronger, but... Okay, you know what? That's probably what we're going to be doing, okay? We're going to go to the relic passage, okay? Because they're getting stuff situated, I, again, don't know what I'm doing here. So, let's see, where are we going next, okay? We're going to be battling some trainers. We're going to grab these items, like PP up, because, you know, it's always nice to have these kinds of, uh... Item from here to increase our PP and well, let's see. Talk to this person crossing the ocean. Don sure look lonely. Okay, so that's not the place to go. Let's go right ahead and go right over here. And uh, yeah, we're gonna be exploring some stuff right here. So let's see. Talk to this person. What kind of trainers will come to battle me? Okay, nope. All right, this is getting annoying. Where in the mother loving place is uh, the relic passage? Okay, so oh, there it is. Okay, so let's go straight to the relic passes. Let's uh, let's do some exercise, guys. Let's get our Pokemon strong because, well, apparently we're not worthy for the the place right there for the world tournament. So, yeah, we should get our Pokemon a little bit stronger right here. Talk to me, please. I'm here collecting shards. So, okay, top moves that way they could. Okay, and crap baskets. We have to find. Well, we're not gonna be finding some stuff right here. And that sounds like we need a repel. Okay, so let's see, where is the repel? There we go. Super. You serious? We only had one repel. Good gravy. Yeah, okay. Alrighty, so let's go. I'm checking my, um, yeah, I'm getting, uh, you know, I'm getting my, uh, we're just getting my, my stuff ready right here. So here we go, taking on Backpacker Aileen, and she is coming out with, oh, look at that, a Sand Slash, and it's at level 32. So yes, we're definitely going to be going in for a huge battle right here. And, well, let's see, Sand Slash is not a uh, special attacker. We couldn't use that other move, but yes, we're going to be using this, the Side Beam, and Crap Baskets, it, ha it does have Slash, so here we go, Side Beam attack for the win. And here comes another slash. Hopefully that's not a crit. And well, that does take us to the red. So here we go, side beam again for the win. How's it feel to fail, sand slash? That's right. Okay, so that's more experience points. Gigalith grows to level 25, and Desert Storm is growing too. That way we can get it. We can get a dragon on our team. You know who doesn't like dragons? Seriously, if you don't like dragons, there's something wrong. And crud. I completely forgot about the level the level thing and all that stuff. Um, let's see, yes, Gigalith, level 25, so that is probably not going to protect us from any of these wild Pokemon. So, let's go right ahead and switch out these Pokemon right here. Let's go straight for Shadar. Now, I do realize that we, uh, we might encounter another Pokemon here and there, but Shadar can get it done. Just trust me, guys. And I think we need strength for that. Do we have strength? I think so. I don't know. But we're getting attacked by another Pokemon right here. And it's the name of Woobat. Oh, crit baskets. Okay, so Woobat, you are being annoying. Okay, so I'm going to run away because I don't want to mess with you. And wow. Okay, so. Come on. That's right. Leave me alone. All right, so we have five badges. I'm pretty sure we should. I'm pretty sure we do have a strength technique right here. And uh, yes, we do. Okay, so first is first. Actually, hold on. Crap, what did I do? Let's go back. Okay, so let's go back to... No, not, let's not do that. You know what? Let's use a mouse. This is the reason why we got a mouse right here. Okay, so let's sort these items by the number. That way, 
we can actually find our stuff right here. And it looks like we do have the strength technique, so let's go right ahead and teach that to a Pokemon with some high attack. That right there happens to be Shadar. And let's go ahead and take away Headbutt. Okay, so there we go. And it looks like... I think we are unable to actually use crap baskets. Yeah. The, the strength technique, so yes. Let's go right ahead and battle some Pokemon right here. Now, if it does sound like a... If, if my vocals sound a little weird due to the microphone, it is probably because I'm going back to the whole uh, Yeti microphone. Um, found some different features onto it and then didn't, didn't exactly use them and crud. That is a strong Pokemon. But yeah, I found some different features and all that stuff and I found a sound or a power. I can't even say that right right here, but I found a, uh, a pop blocker that actually pops a block and you know now it sounds a little a little clear right there and crud it is uh, gaining its attack so we've got to beat this Pokemon. But yes, and look at that critical hit, how does it feel to fail? Look at that, Shadar using its moxie, just like John Moxley, that's right. And here comes a Rog and Rolla, a Pokemon specifically built for Shadar to beat in one hit. Too bad it probably won't. Probably won't beat it in one hit. So there we go. Rick break. And yes, I told you. And here comes that stealth rock. So luckily for us, we are not switching out our Pokemon. We're just gonna ride this whole momentum of Moxie onto, onto our good old buddy uh, right here, Shida. And look at that, Shida defeats this Pokemon, and here comes more Moxie. Yes, sir. Okay, so let's see. There it is. Hiker has been defeated. And well, let's see, now we can move this boulder right here, and yes, we are unable to use so. Shadar. There we go. That's right, we're pushing it, pushing it, pushing it. Where does this lead? Nobody knows. Oh, it's a shortcut. Never mind. Okay, so I kind of wasted my time right there. And this one right here will lead us into another area right here. Holy crap. Okay, so we do need strength, but we will be finding some Pokemon trainers right here. And... Let's see. Let's go straight to Sigh of the Torrent. It is very, very close to actually evolving. And this guy will be looking at us. And yes. Okay, so let's see. Uh, the Relic Passage right here. We're going to be finding some pretty interesting Pokemon. Doesn't really matter. Because I'm going to defeat them all. But the usual Pokemon you'll find Gurger, Boulder, Onyx, Raticate. You know, you can find Raticate in here. And uh, yes, the obvious Rubats and all that stuff. And on the water, you know, you got your Basculins, uh, Meryl, Azumarill, you know, some of these Pokemon are pretty cool to actually have. Poliwhirl, Poliwrath, you know, these are the rare Pokemon that you can actually get through Ripples, I think. And, well, let's go right ahead, Razor Shell, for the win, and there we go, Rugged Rolla has been defeated. And, well, let's see, coming out with a Timber, let's go straight to, uh, you know, the Pokemon that we can use in Crap Baskets. I completely forgot to heal this Pokemon, so we are entering, in, yeah, we are entering at our, uh, at our, at a, at a risk right now. So let's go straight for, uh, 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 uh. let's go with Psybeam. And, let's see, Psybeam for the win, please. And there we go, for the win, okay. All right, so my Pokemon are responding pretty well right here. Almost, uh, almost crapped my pants a little, and you know what? Bear with me a little bit, guys. I'm getting text message up. You know what? I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so we're back. Been getting a lot of text messages, guys. Lots and lots of text messages. It's gonna continue right here. But look at this. We found ourselves a blue shard. Not bad. And well, before we do anything, I was supposed to heal a Pokemon. Not there. And well, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Ah, there we go. Super potions. You gotta love those super potions. Let's give it to Gigalith and Shadar because, well, you know, you may never know. And, yes, the goal is to try and evolve two of the... Th well, we got, like, three Pokemon right here that were, are close to evolution. It's within the next few episodes. Uh, it just... It, it's just... It's gonna be a while. Now, that only repel that we have, or the super repel we have, is done. Now, let me check to see if I actually have uh, regular repels. And it looks like I don't. Holy biscuits. Okay, so yeah. Huh. Yeah, I came in unprepared. So, uh, let's see. Screw it. Let's go right ahead. We're just going to speed through the Pokemon right here. And, well, let's go ahead and press that speed button. There we go. We found ourselves a Raticade. We can get stronger right here, guys. But we're not. Oh, crap. Yeah, we kind of have to. 
Alright, this Pokemon. Again. Radicates, you gotta love them. And let's go ahead and start battling. Alrighty, so let's go right here. I'll borrow this Ruin's Power to power up my own Psychic Powers. Okay, alright, cool, cool, cool. Whatever you say, homeboy, but guess what? You're about to lose. You're about to lose a lot. So here we go, Psychic totally wants the battle. And he is coming out with a Swoobat, the full evolved version of this uh, full Woobat thingy. And, well, let's see. Let's go right ahead and go with the Razor Shell. Again, some of these Pokemon are pretty strong. Well, stronger than us. And this could be a good place to actually try and, and, and you know, grow some levels. Trying to get ready to the Pokemon League Tournament, or not the, the, the World Tournament and all that crud. And, well, there it is. Leftovers can help us out right here. And here comes an Air Slash attack. Let's see what would happen. And that right there will hit us pretty hard. So here we go, another Razor Shell. And that right there nearly defeats this guy. But its defense is down. Hopefully, you know, side doesn't go bye bye and all that crud. And this, yes, Air Slash has been avoided. And Swoobat has been defeated. Okay, alrighty. And Tully has been defeated. Okay, so that's, uh, okay, okay. That was a close call right there. But you gotta love these potions right here. So let's go ahead and give these potions to the side because, well, we kinda don't want to get defeated now. You know what? I've been missing him for quite some time. And I could evolve him right here too. Four out of the five, or four of the six Pokemon I can evolve right now. But I kinda wanna wait for, like, you know, special moves and all that crap, guys. So here we go, another little bat. And. Well, we're gonna run away. Good gravy, okay. You know what? <sighs> Firefang. Call mine, yes, get it, there we go, call mine, kisses us, we're in love, really, okay, there we go, Firefang, love is not powerful, than butt kiss, okay, so, this is getting ridiculous, okay, so here we go, a Bulldor, and, yes, we're gonna <laughs> move out of the way right there, so, let me just, uh, hmm, yeah, we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be in here for quite some time, and I know that I'm kind of slacking a little, guys. But okay, so we're gonna stop it right here. In the next episode, we're gonna you know take care of this whole business right here because this is getting ridiculous. I'm gonna get more repels. We're gonna train up a little bit and then start battling everybody because it, yeah, this is I kind of feel like I'm slacking a little bit. So yeah, sorry again, guys. I yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode as we are fully trained and ready to go. See you guys.